Hello, I wonder how people say they are preparing for jam and they don't have the jam syllables. They don't have their jam syllables. In this video, I'm going to give you three things you need to smash your jam. The first thing is have your jam syllables. The second thing is get the recommended textbook. And the third thing is discipline yourself. All right, so the first topic, uh, the, in this video, I'm going to be bringing to you the syllabus of chemistry chemistry jam syllabus so all you have to do is get your pen and your book and write out the topics as i'm calling them chemistry jam syllabus ensure you cover all these topics and you score high there's nothing that will stop you all right so the first topic you are expected to cover in chemistry th this syllabus i'm going to give now is the recent one the updated one so don't use a last year syllabus this syllabus is a 2026 2027 jam all right so the first one here is separation of mixtures and purification of chemical substances. So you are to read uh, separation of mixtures and purification of chemical substances. That is pure and impure substance, no boiling and melting points, elements, compounds and mixtures, chemical and physical changes, separation techniques, the offer under that one. So that's the first topic you have to know. The second one in chemistry is chemical combination. So in chemical combination, know all the laws of chemical combination, laws of definite proportion, multiple proportion, reciprocal proportion, law of conservation of matter, know all those ones. Then the third thing, the third topic you have to read in chemistry is kinetic theory of matter and gas laws. Kinetic theory of matter and gas laws. So you are to know the phenomena that supports kinetic theory. Of matter then all the gas laws as boys law charles law id gas equation and the rest you have to know them also the fourth topic in chemistry you are you must know is atomic structure and bonding so you should know the different models Dalton's theory rutherford model thompson's model Bohr's model the atomic theory you should know them very well atomic structure bonding the periodic table and all the types of chemical bonding like electrovalent bonding covalent bonding bonding coordinate covalent bonding you should know them under that topic then shapes of simple molecules you have to know them too all right then the next thing you are to note the next the fifth topic in chemistry you must know is air 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 is a topic so you should know uh, you should read that the natural gases that that is that makes up air know that so the next topic the sixth topic you must know these are topics that are question concentrated so you must know them next one is water water the next one is solubility so under solubility you should know the unsaturated saturated and super saturated solutions you should know your solubility calculation solubility curve hope you are writing out all these things please write them out and if you're not subscribed to my channel please click on the subscribe button i'm going to give syllabus so all the subjects so in case you need the jam syllabus the written jam syllabus that is the most updated one the one that they will set questions from in 2026 any subjects you need just drop it in the comment section and i will drop it Number eight, the eighth topic you need to note is environmental pollution. So you should know about air pollution, water pollution, soil pollution. Then number nine, the ninth topic is acids, bases, and salts. Acids, bases, and salts. So you should know that the all the calculations under that pH, pOH, acid-base titration, and other things you should note. Know them. The tenth one is oxidation and reduction. That is redox reaction. Know how to balance redox reaction. Know how to balance redox reaction very well. Then electron transfer, receiving of electron, oxidation reduction. Ensure you master them. Number 11, which you will see question from is electrolysis. Electrolysis. So know what electrolytes are, non-electrolytes, uh, electrolysis factors affecting discharge of ions at the electrodes read all those things uses of electrolysis and all that things under electrolysis ensure you come down to read them use recommended textbooks 
all right you'll be asking what are the recommended textbooks i'll tell you at the end of this video number 12 energy changes so you should read about entropy enthalpy read them very well number 13 rates of chemical reaction know the factors that affect rates of chemical reaction this one question used to come from this one very well so know how concentration affects chemical react the rates catalyst catalyst surface area and the rest how they affect the rate of chemical reaction number 14 is chemical equilibria chemical equilibria that's irreversible reactions learn them number 15 is non-metals and their compounds non-metals and their compounds so you read all the non-metals Re read about hydrogen read about halogens read about uh, oxygen and sulfur read about nitrogen trioxonitrates oxides of nitrogen nitrogen cycle and others then number 16 metals and their compounds metals and their compounds number 17 now organic compounds that's organic chemistry read organic chemistry know how to name your organic compounds arcane arcanes arcanes arcanons know all the functional groups know all the functional groups all right then number 18 chemistry and industry so no chemical industry no the types of chemical industry raw materials and their relevance now i've given you 18 topics 18 topics how do you cover them plan yourself now to cover them if you don't know how to plan it drop it in the comment section i'll give you hints on how to plan on covering all these topics because you cover these 18 topics Trust me, you, there's no way you score less than 90 in chemistry jam. There's no way if you cover them well and use pass question. I made a video on the, be, the, the right way to use pass question, the best way to prepare for your jam. So you can go and watch that. So what are, what are the recommended textbooks? But please, if not subscribe, click on the subscribe button. If not like this video, like this video and share it to others too. Because some persons are preparing without knowing the syllables. Like you're reading blindly. Use the syllables. Anyone you've read, you take it right. Anyone you anyone you read you take it right. Anyone you read you take it right. That's the best way to prepare. All right, the recommended textbooks. The first one here is Ababio, New School Chemistry. This was the one I used in my own time. In fact, this is the most known textbook, Ababio. Ababio, New School Chemistry for senior secondary schools. Fourth edition, specific, fourth edition. And that's the most recent edition. Another one you can use is Senior Secondary Chemistry, book two and three. Long man, long man. The author is Baja St. Taibo B O Obikwere Onwu. Then the third recommended textbook here. These ones are 2026 Jam recommended textbook. Number three here is Ojukuku Understanding Chemistry. I started using this one recently when I'm teaching, and it's a very good one. Understanding Chemistry is good. So Understanding Chemistry for schools and colleges, you can buy that one too. Then. You, the fourth recommended textbook here is essential essential chemistry then the second edition then the fifth recommended textbook here is countdown to work sse neko jam jam chemistry all right so in addition to all this i recommend you use prep 50 and your test driller or any of the or my school app to prepare yourself so any topic you've covered you go to my school you select that topic you do pass questions on it or use your prep 50 if you don't have a laptop you prep 50 prep 50 is arranged in such a way that uh, in, in such a way that you will get questions on a particular topic you've read that will go a long way if you're not subscribed subscribe to my channel if dropped in the comment section the next syllables i should give the next subject any subject you want me to drop the syllabus drop in the comment section before i end this video for if you've noticed the trend, there's a trend that people feel English very well. People feel English very well. Take check statistics in jam. English is the most fit subject because people don't know how to prepare for it. All right. Now I have a textbook for you. Something that if you go to summarize, you summarize everything you need to know. Everything you need to know in English to so you smart your jam. People don't even read English. That's one mistake they make. So I'll drop the link of that textbook in the description of this video. So just click on the description of this video. You see the link to the English textbook. It's an online textbook. It's a soft copy. So you click on it. Click on it. And 
you'll be directed from there in absence of any question if you have any question drop it in the comment section but if there is no question see you in my next video my name is excellence simplified